buddy. How are you doing today? Yes, I did do a haul yesterday. It sat around here so long that I got a fuzzy here. That um, it was time to do. I was time for me to go to the Dollar Tree again. So Ron went in with me. He knew I was very angry with him about something. So he was picking up stuff and going, "Oh, this would be cute in our lawn," and blah 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 blah. And I found it a little cute and amusing. Um, I like when he's trying to make up to me <laughs> for something. It's quite humorous. Anyway, and I saw my daughter working, and we were discussing some things, and I told her, I gave her some money, and I said, look out for a couple things for me, and when you see him, grab him right away. So well, she said she would. So anywho... Let's see, what's new? The reason I was at the Dollar Tree yesterday, actually, was because I went for my um, appointment to discuss all my test results and stuff, and um, I couldn't find my wallet. And that became a big issue. And then I sat down, and I retraced all my steps, and I remembered where it was. So... I found the wallet. Uh, by the time I got there, she said, well, you're going to have to reschedule because uh, she's very backed up, blah, blah, blah. She's going to be gone next week on vacation. So the first day you can see her is, and it was like almost the end of, uh, I can't even think what month it is, August. So I said, mm. She had said you could see someone else, and I said, I really don't want to see someone else. And then I said, okay, fine, I'll I'll see someone else. So I'm going to see a new nurse practitioner, but just for this one time, because I really love my doctor, my nurse practitioner, and I don't want to change. So anyway, um, that's news. And also there's news that Ron will be having his surgery for his uh, cancer again on uh, next Thursday, so I will keep you posted on that. But uh, in the meantime, this weekend, yes, is Las Vegas weekend. And they have been handing out bo bogus money for about a month and a half now. And uh, so they're going to have like a silent auction and you can bid on stuff and so forth and so on. And uh, they'll have, you know, like games like uh, dice and things. And they have a beer garden and all that jazz. And our neighbors right behind us are having a huge family gathering as well. So this is going to be a really crazy, busy weekend. And then we, i got to be at church early on Sunday. And then we're going to go home for a couple days. Uh, I need to regroup. Uh, in fact, it wasn't, my mouth isn't moving. I need to regroup and get some... Um, I need to get all the laundry done and jazz like that. So I'm trying to get a bunch of stuff done here right now. Uh, do a few things now, and I'm going to run over to the pool for a while and then come back and make dinner. Ron's going to go to the store, blah, blah, blah. I have a lot of blah, blah, blahs, don't I? I should just tell you the stuff instead of going blah, blah, blah. Anyway, that's just how goofy I am. So I have this here uh, Dollar Tree haul, and it's a bunch of stuff. So I probably should shut my... Um, face and start showing you what I got here. And I got a lot of bags, and I'm sorry if I got to reach on the floor and stuff, but um, it's just too hard to have everything drag it around 50 times. I found it's easier, in a way, just to do it in the living room because uh, the, the door we bring it in is right here instead of me dragging it back there by the table. So anyway, it's a little bit easier for me here. So we begin. This is, Ron bought this for his desk. Uh, I told him, he said, oh, those are pretty handy. I said, I always had a desk pad calendar. Um, they used to be very fancy, and they had like a, you just changed them out, and they had like a, I don't know what you want to call it. This one's just what it is, and um, maybe I can fancy it up for him a little bit. But it helps him know what days it is, uh, I hope. So far, nothing's worked, but this might. I ha I feel hope. Let's see. What did we have in this day? I found the popcorners. These, though, are white cheddar. We only bought one bag. Ron said they were really good, but I didn't know he'd ever had them. But uh, 
Yes, so we bought one bag of those. Well, hi again, guys. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, my phone just took a crap on me, and I had to... <coughs> Excuse me. I had to take it all apart and put it back together, and there we go. So, I was talking about these here popcorners. Maybe, maybe it doesn't like popcorners, but anyway... Um, we got four bags of these popcorners that are the kettle corn. And they're so delicious and fun to eat while you're watching a movie. Or other things. So, let's see. I see something small here. Oh. They had all kinds of little string lights. Um, they had uh, unicorns and they had pineapples and they had these little flamingos. And, of course, I got the Flamingos, and they are a battery one. They take two AA batteries. So I will probably put these on. No, I don't think I'll put them in my golf cart. Um, I might put them in the window or something because uh, they're really delicate, it looks like. So I'll probably put them in the window. Okay. Bag of number two. I bought some powder. They, I've been looking and looking for this, and they finally got it in. And I got it for Ron to use, and I might put some on my back because it's itching so bad. And I bought six of these. Um, I need these in my new place. I have to put them everywhere, and because uh, I like it to smell nice. And. Um, they just came back with the cashmere wood ones, which they use in the fall and winter. So I got six of those. Now, I could have probably gotten a few cents cheaper at the um, Walmart, but the way my day was going, I wasn't going to make it to Walmart. So I bought them there. I'm going to make sure I got them. All right, now we have another bag. And in this bag is, I. they had some of the plaques out. They did not have the trucks, but um, I did like this one, Bless Our Home, and um, so I got this to put when you walk in the door. You can see it as you walk in the door at my house, and I got, I don't even know what I bought. Um, I bought a power stick body spray. These are nice for, you know. They're nice. It smells really good. Um, I needed to beef up my stockpile here of um, dish detergent, so I got the Ultra Palm Olive Oxy with Power Degreaser. And I bought these Tang. There's six packets for to put in water. Um... I've had these before, and I really liked them. I like orange-flavored drinks, so I thought that'd be good. Now, I have this. Ron wanted me to buy this one for some reason, and I told him that I already had a bunch like this, but he was he liked the way it was striped. As I said, he was being very condescending or something like that. But anyway, it was cool. He said, they'll look really nice in the center of the coffee table. I said, yes, that they will, and I will make. I have now a variety of pumpkins, and I will make sure that I do that. Uh, they had these. These were from last year, I believe, maybe the year before last. They had them marked down to 50 cents, and so I bought one. Hopefully, when I take that off, it doesn't peel away. But it's the Living Dead Restaurant Creepy Cuisine. Alarming appetizers, beastly beverages, eerie entrees, and deadly desserts. Now, I can use this at home, but come to think of it, it might be really cute for my uh, son-in-law to use in his restaurant at Halloween time. So I'll ask him. If he doesn't want it, I'll use it in my own house, in my kitchen. Alrighty. Um, we need some flashlights at our new place, because I believe I left them all at the other house. And they probably all don't work again, so... Um, I got one. I like these triple 
they're really bright. And uh, so I got that. Um, I'll tell you, this is in random order, and I am so sorry. But I don't know what to do about it. Um, I bought a chicken broth because I realized I didn't have any here, and I was thinking of making a couple of things that I might need chicken broth for, so I got that. I bought these for my grandson. I have a bunch of pencils, but I've had them for a long time. They were um, his grandpa's, ex, my ex-husband's, uh, from work, and I thought he, you know, he could use them and just put these new pencil things on them. Um, I bought some uh, of the tool, and I know that the glitter drops from this kind of bad, but I like it anyway. Um, I got two of the, it's like a maroonish color. Um, I got two orange. This is one of them. This is a basket that Ron got. He wants it on his, by his desk for incoming papers, he said. It's kind of big. I already have some there, but I'll get him a smaller one. I think he's going to realize how big it is. And let's see here. Then I also got two of this gold color. Of the tool. I'm going to make a wreath, a fall wreath. I have one I've been using for years. It's wood, and I'm getting tired of it, so I thought I'd make myself one. I love the tool, wreaths made out of tool. So here's the other orange. And there is, uh, how many feet on here? Because I hope I have enough. Oh, there is three yards. So I'm hoping with you know, all these that I bought that it'll, you know, be enough. Um, believe it or not, one of my overhead lights in my um, ex my spare room ha uses these kind of bulbs on the end. So I didn't have any when the lights burn out, so I went and bought some. Those say they're 40 watts. I think the other I bought were 60. Uh, oh, well. Um, Ron bought himself some soothing aloe barbasol. Um, these, I was so excited when I saw these. And Ron said, would you please wrap everything that'll break? He's my hero. I finally found, and these are the only, the ones I bought were the only two colors they had. They didn't even have a lot of these but the real heavy pumpkins. And so I got a green one. I picked one that had quite a bit of gold and it had gold on the leaf. These are awesome. And the other one, let's see, I don't know if this is the other one. It doesn't feel as heavy. This is another one I bought. I bought several ones that I didn't have. Um, I like these kind of modeled ones, but I don't have one like this with the orange on it. So I got that. Got to figure out how I'm going to do this. I'm going to have to put like some greenery or something on and all the pumpkins. I can make it a pumpkin patch. I also have some, and I know I have it somewhere, a bunch of um, Charlie Brown Halloween stuff. I got to find that because I didn't have anything out last year because I couldn't do anything because I had just had the surgery so this, I missed a year of decorating and then I got the white one I got the best they had I think that's gonna look really cool so I got those um I got another pumpkin I thought these, Ron said these look like um, Cinderella pumpkins. I got that one. They had white too, but I liked this one. It's kind of cream color. So I got that one. I got some more drink mixes. Ron bought a few. Uh, let's see. He got cherry pomegranate, Welch's. There's six. He got Weiler's Light Lemonade. There's 10 of them. I told him I had some here still because uh, I used to drink them all the time. 
And uh, I've had them, I bought so many and I have had them so long, they probably don't taste very good anymore. Uh, strawberry peach, they might, I don't know. I don't have these flavors though. And cranberry grape. So he picked those. Um, and then I found this tool and it's got, it's like a cr creamy brown color and it's got these copper colored leaves. So I also bought two of these and there's three yards in these also. So I have three, six, let's see, six, ten, three. I have 18 yards of tool. Hopefully that's enough. Um, they had all the, uh, they did have all the burlap leaves, but I didn't buy any. I did buy these though to put on my, um, wreath. I thought they would be pretty. Okay. Then I got me some candy. Because I've been wanting some candy. I got me some Haribo Happy Cherries. And some Twizzlers. Filled twist candies in, it looks like orange cream. It doesn't say, but it looks like it's an orange cream. Orange cream. Wow. Boy, oh boy, 90 calories for two of them. Woo! All right. Let's see. Here we go. Uh, Ron bought this wire brush. I told him he needs to start looking at stuff in there more because they have a lot of stuff you could use. And here's some more tool. Let's see. I found the letters that say thankful, harvest, and welcome. And uh, I, I wouldn't even have found them if I hadn't been standing and talking to my daughter. I happened to see them over her shoulder. And uh, I said, oh, I've been wanting those. She said, yeah, I think those have a lot of promise. She said, I bought a couple of them. So I bought two because... You just never know what you might want to make out of them. That's one of them. Uh, this I'd never seen before, and I thought it was actually very cute. And it's all felt. I love felt stuff. And it's all jointed. It reminds me of when I was a kid, they had cardboard ones that were jointed like this. So I bought this. Um, not sure what I'll do with it. Am I hanging on my door? I don't know. I'll just keep changing things on my door. I almost need to because I have so much junk. Now, interestingly, I found some stuff. Um, I made um, a Halloween fairy garden probably about two or three years ago and for a collab. And I didn't couldn't find any figures, little people figures. And they had them at the Dollar Tree. Obviously, they'd had them for a while for 50 cents. And uh, there's a witch and looks like the Hunchback of Notre Dame. And the other one looks like maybe Boris Karloff. And then there's a gargoyle and Frankenstein and an ugly lady with a white dress on. So I bought these to put in my thing. I made it in one of those kettles, black kettles. Hopefully it's okay. If not, I'll have to remake it. Been in the garage for a couple of years. Oh, here's the other bulbs. These are yeah, these are 60 watt. I should have looked when I was buying them. Um, they had a, a, a quite a few of the newer stickers you guys have been showing. I did not buy a lot because, well, just because. I have so many stickers, I don't even know what to do with them all. I did buy these, though, because I thought they were absolutely adorable. Because they have to do with traveling. And somebody, God willing, I'm going to get to travel. And i got to get the some of this stuff out of the way, because this guy is waving at you. I've got the air on and the fan. All right. And the other thing, and here is the other letters.
All right, we're getting close. We're getting close. I got to hurry here. Um, I got another box of tissues for the truck. Um, another flashlight. This one says it's super bright. 100 lumens. Don't know exactly what that means. But anyway. uh, Ron bought some razors to try. The Barbasol Twin Blade. I think I would have went with something a little bit more, but that's what he bought. Um, they, I found these. They had one of these chewy uh, lemon heads. These are the very awesome ones. And then I got the tropical fruit one. I thought I got a different one. But anywho. So I got them. So I'm hooked up for ca with candy for a while. Uh, let's see. This is more popcorners. Um, got another box of my crackers. And Ron got a bag of peanuts. Hampton Farms peanuts. And there's one of those. Oh, and they also got salted peanuts in a bag. This man is obsessed with salted peanuts. All right, hang on, guys. All right, this is my last two bags. He tried for about the 80th time to buy Worcestershire sauce. I said, we've got some. I got two at home and one in the camper. Then he was going to buy A1 steak sauce, and I said, we already have some of that, but we don't have this. So he bought a bill. Heinz 57 steak sauce. I don't look for it because he doesn't put it on the steak. He bought a Bullseye Everyday Barbecue Sauce Original. But I have Sweet Baby Ray's here already. And they had Sunny D uh, singles also, and there's six in here. And I thought I would try these and compare them with the, um, what do you call them? Uh, Tang ones. And that, people, I believe, is my haul. Nope, nope. One more thing. More, more pop corners. Uh, another flashlight with the. And then I know I don't have one of these metallic ones like this. So I got that. I thought that was so pretty. All right. So that is my haul. And it is ridiculous how big it is again. But uh, Ron bought all kind of stuff that we don't need. But anywho. It was fun, and I hope you guys are having a great day. I'm excited about this weekend. I was up all night with my knee hurting, but I'm hoping that no matter what, I can do some stuff this week. And so I will see you in my next video. Probably it'll be at home. I'm hopefully going to do some kind of crafting video. And I want you to know that I love you a long time, and please stay crafty. Bye, guys.